J-Lo, your whole come up is off dark <laughs> insertions. Your <laughs> got beat up by dark <laughs> So it's about time uh. you pay some homage to black d- uh. In this video, we got comedian Corey Holcomb pointing out the fact that everybody tried to take away from what black people have done in this society. Let me give you an example of how this game go. The Golden State Warriors won a championship, right? And, and, and they said, big up to the Mexican player. Uh, the, the tennis girl who was number one at time. Uh -huh. One, number one at one time. They was like, big up to the Asian girl. Mm -hmm. Nobody, because I saw that boy who played for Golden State. That's a nigga. <laughs> That's where he got his running and jumping from. The black side mm -hmm. of his motherfucking family. That's why he was in the NBA Finals, because somebody got fucked on the black person side of the game. <laughs> And this is the point I'm trying to make about these motherfuckers. Just like with the, what is it, Osaka, is that her name? Yeah. yeah. They tried to say that she was an Asian girl. Tennis sensation Naomi Osaka have a Haitian dad and Japanese mom, but they never acknowledge the black side of her family. If you Google her, it says she's Japanese, but if she ever get in trouble with the law, I bet they're going to update it to black. <laughs> they didn't talk about the black dick that created her! <laughs> <laughs> well, they were probably so excited to actually go, oh my God, we got somebody in there. It's called caking for a motherfucker. No, with I'm, right there. no I get All the real motherfuckers. I don't. do get it where some people would get so damn excited that they just go, oh my God, we got somebody. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're in there. Oh, it's like, okay, it's only a little bit. Man, it's that it's long like time hell. ago. Once you got some black in, your ass black. No. So, what I'm trying to say is this D, you said, you said J Lo. It she was did for, what? that's what it was for. It was for initiative coincides with National Small Business Week and National Hispanic Heritage Month. Right. It was the, they were talking about black Latinos, which they call like Dominican Republic, like Dominican people. I, I saw dark. her big up in Latino women. I did not see her big up in black women. And it's a point I want to make today. Sure. Here's the Believe point. Believe me, I'm oh, not go putting, go, I'm sorry. Believe me. I'm not like putting up for her per se. Because I don't know exactly the whole story. I have to, I'd have to check it out when you called me at the last minute. However, also, I, I don't have, I have like, I wouldn't say beef, but she actually did me wrong. Who? <laughs> J-Lo. Well, like, yeah, I don't want to. What? Well, back in the day? No, a couple years ago. Oh. Yeah, I mean, I don't want to speak on it because there's a mutual friend that's in between both of this like this. But anyway, I was very disappointed because I, look, I, I didn't like look up to her, but I, I liked her. I was like, oh my God, I'm so proud. There's a Latino, you know what I'm saying? She's Puerto Rican, but I was like, oh my God, our girl's doing something. Look how big she's getting. And then I had this incident happen a couple years ago and I was like, ugh. Anyway. What's All right, so let so me anyway, put the so hoe she, out there like I meant to do. Yeah, go for it. What up, Goop? J-Lo, if you see this, I want to tell you something. I didn't see you big up in black women. And you don't have to, but one thing you should big up hmm. is black dick, bitch. You came up <laughs> off black dick. You was a dancer on in living color. I know how the game go. You was fucking somebody. Oh. oh and wow. nigga in the entertainment been to know. Bitch, you still here. Uh. You fucking somebody. What's understood ain't got to be said. Oh my lord. You fucking somebody, bitch. Didn't see that coming. I know you didn't see it coming. Uh, yeah. See, you gotta be a black person to see how you don't get your propers. Oh my lord. You have to be black to see it. They're not big up in us. J Lo was big up in Latino women and said how it would be a good investment for them to do this with Latino women. I didn't see her say it's a good investment to do that with black women. J Lo, your whole come up is of dark dick insertions. All you get is because of black dick, bitch. So it's about time you pay some homage to black dick. White slave owners couldn't sleep at night because they Caucasian wife was getting rotted out in the barn 
every time they went to town for goods. Black dick deserves its proper credit in this society. J-Lo, it's about time you say if it wasn't for my brothers over there that live in color, cause see, what's the man name? Wayans. The Wayans. What's the real funny Caucasian dude name who was on the show? Jim, Jim Carrey. Jim Carrey always give credit to Keenan now. He pay homage, he know I popped cause they took a chance on me. Right. Yeah. Jim Carrey once tweeted, Brilliant black minds gave me a shot in Hollywood when none of the white guys thought I could connect or be a leading man. I got my first starring role, Ace Ventura, because of In Living Color. Hashtag forever grateful. Hopefully one day we could talk about how the Wayans brothers don't really get the recognition they deserve. They've helped a lot of actor slash actress catch their first break, like Jim Carrey, Jennifer Lopez, Jamie Foxx, Tommy Davidson, and many more. Right. Yeah. When you gonna say that, J-Lo? When you gonna say you pop because them Wayans boys took a chance on your jitty sitting on the black block ass? But see, that's the thing. They always want to benefit from us and then don't want to stand with us. That's why I'm talking about it. Because I watch when they be giving credit to certain people. I watch what happens. I'm like, they didn't, they didn't say where it came from. They just, like when you make it, oh, I, my Latino heritage. Bitch, your pussy got beat up by dark dick. Your career started by the dark dick you was fucking to let you dance on in living color. Well, one of the Wayans, please come on here and tell the true story oh, of how this bitch got any opportunity. I know y'all. Okay. Them Wayans some real ass niggas, to be honest. Yeah. They don't give a fuck. Keenan don't give a fuck, nigga. Keenan, will you please come on to 5150 and tell us how this bitch got everything she got? <laughs> Who was fucking the hoe? Which one of y'all? Oh my God, that is just, that's crazy. <laughs> what do you mean it's crazy? She got black dick power. No, I'm saying what well, she got. She got power from the black dick. Right. right. That's what got the, the talent good. I'm mean, saying, man, you got to give us ours, man. Stop taking from us. When you get up here and you made it off sitting on black dick, you are supposed to say, thank God to the Wayans. You are supposed to say, even if, because you Latino, I can say you saying Latino first. Latino women and black women deserve grants and all this shit to help catch them up for what we've been held back on over the years. You didn't say that. You took up for only yours. And ain't nothing wrong with taking up for yours. But you must pay homage for the dick that did. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, Jamie Foxx would probably tell that ass. Up. Right. Jamie Foxx was like, oh. that joke Jamie Foxx said was funny as hell. Mother calling her J Lo. They was like, that ain't how it went on set. We was like, hey ho. We already know she got a fetish for dick. Yeah. We already know she got it's women out here with dick fetishes for real. They can't just fuck one person. A year. Uh, they got to have that pussy beat down by multiple men. And I think J Lo fits that category oh, from what we see. She done been married a few times, lately. That's her hustle. Oh. Yeah. And she'll marry a brother. What you talking about? Look at this. So no, no, but I'm gonna defend her. No, I don't. As a matter of fact, I just told you we had like I don't know what her problem is with me, but you, no. You but I'm, I'm so proud of her. You need to have a talk with her. You need to walk up to J Lo and say, Bitch, we came up off black dick. <laughs> <laughs> I gave my dues. Hey. I